Tonight is a night of good nights. I'm going to refuse and restrain myself from saying anything about how I'm playing right now. I just have this thing. I just have this delusion in my mind as soon as I start talking about certain ways I'm playing, it's just bad. Last night it was all about the rookies. It was all about the new faces of baseball last night. Tonight is going to be a little bit old fashioned right now. Everybody put on grease and start blowing into your Nintendo 64 cartridges. This is going to be old school of old school players right now. This is only going to be throwbacks in this game. Now there isn't really a certain destination for a year what is considered a throwback, it's just... It's, I didn't even realize it until I put this team together that everybody besides Johnny Bench is a 99. Well, at least in the starting lineup, because if there was an upgraded version of Johnny Bench, then he would probably be a 99 too. So this would have the potential to be all 99 team. Again, there's familiar faces all over the place, but there's also some people who I would probably like to use who I haven't used a lot yet. It might be always a good evening when the killer is in the lineup. So on this fine evening tonight, Johnny Bench will be behind it. Or behind the plate. Be behind the night, whatever that means. But this is not anywhere close to good. It was defense, and this is very much good, but offensively, that is not gonna get the job done, most likely. He also has kind of a pathetic batting stance, so this this is pretty much just a waste in the lineup. Stan the man will be at first base this game. I've honestly only used Stan minimal times. My ass is a huge fan of Stan, and he's only been in the lineup for 11 games. That's not good. Whenever you can get Stan in the lineup is going to be a good night, I should have said. Opposite of Johnny Bench, everything offensively is good. But also, opposite of Johnny Bench too, there comes a time where bad things happen. Kind of doing awful with Jackie Robinson every single time I've been using him this year. It's not been good, I'll tell you that much, for the display I've been putting on. So, if it, listen. This is the day. Ernie Banks is at short, and I haven't even used him once in DD. I thought I used him at least once. I don't even have a stat to show. I have been hearing that this is the best shortstop in the game still. So thank fuck, he's finally here. Like I said before, if Harmon Killebrew is making an appearance, it's a scary evening. At first it was a good evening, now it's a scary evening. Babe Ruth had to be here. He had to. I don't know what I would have been doing with my life if Babe Ruth wasn't here. Babe is kind of heating up too, so this is the perfect time to have him in the lineup again. Mickey Mantle will be in center field this game. I mean, that's it, I don't fucking know. I have no idea what to say after that. Look at this, Prestige Reggie Jackson is making an appearance. This is perfect for this situation. With Prestige Reggie, he has silver fielding. That boost from bronze to silver is huge. I don't know if there's a larger boost in fielding in this game than from bronze to silver. Anything below silver, pack it the fuck in. The bench, of course, will be throwbacks. I wanted to use Willie McCovey, I really did. I feel like he's very under rated. Say it ain't fucking so. The pitching will all make an appearance. I would have used Walter Johnson again if he was capable, but I used him in one of the last teams I did, and he's definitely gassed. It's probably not even green, red, or yellow. It's probably like light blue for the amount of how much energy he doesn't have. I want to get a home game for this. I have a classic stadium on board for this. If I can play at a home stadium for this specific team, I am going- no, it, never mind. I was going to say something about performance for this game and how I was going to do, but you can't do that. I should just shut up and play. Oh, for the love of fuck. Yes, Kluber. God damn it. He doesn't have a prestige though, so that's good. But he has Larry Walker, oh my shit, he has Larry Walker, Frank, and Cody Bellinger, and Correa. Love it. Good news is, is a home game will be played for this. This is perfect. Is he a Houston fan? Oh my fuck. Now I feel a little bit of pressure now. Someone else I'm not familiar with at all using. Probably be a good idea to use pitchers, especially that I'm familiar with. Otherwise, it's just going to be a display of hanging pitches and that's going to happen every single time. Cody, I fucking swear to shit. I'm not dealing with it tonight. I will accept- I don't even give a fuck if McCutcheon hit home run, that's fine. Larry Walker, Frank, or Cody Bellinger go deep. I am immediate- or Correa, especially. Should probably use the slider if that's his main pitch, right? 
That's the fucking stupidest card in history of Earth. You can't even fucking throw anything to that fucking... Jesus, sit down, Frank! You better get this. Killer? Well, I'm looking forward to this, I'll tell you that much. Kluber on the mound. And his stupid fucking face. Come on, Reggie is going deep this game. At least once. I die! How many fucking times that could happen? I don't want to be beating a dead horse at this point, but this needs to change. If the pause time is not changed next year, I'm knocking on the door with my fucking forehead. This is ridiculous. Motherfuckers are waiting here for fucking hours. What are you doing? Jesus, that's a fucking crazy ass pitch. I'm not gonna get pissed off. Just keep telling myself I'm not gonna get pissed off and I won't get pissed off. What? Oh no? Oh, never mind. Is there a way to look at your home and away splits for winning? I swear to fucking shit. Every time I'm the home team, I lose. That a boy killer. Jesus! What the fuck was his first baseman doing? I'm gonna have to come up with a fucking miracle of a base hit. I got Johnny Bench up and then the fucking pitcher. The bases loaded are going to shit right now. He walked up. I don't want to put a ball on the ground. Yeah, fuck it. The hell with it. I'd rather test my luck with Mickey. Jesus, he might walk in another run. He did. That was a fucking amazing at bat. Hmm. That was... That was fucking awful. We may have to put everybody in the outfield right now to avoid a Larry Walker base hit. Wait, it, oh. Jesus, that may have been amazing. It looked like that was going to be hung around the thighs. That may have been the best inside changeup I've ever thrown. Oh yeah, that is good. That might land though. Jackie has speed. What? Jesus, I already have 61 pitches. That's not good. Thank God I have a bullpen to back my ass up this game. Somewhat good. Well, it's kind of unfortunate I wasn't able to score like 10 runs last inning. Come on, Reggie. I will not be happy until he goes deep. That's gone. See ya! Look at him flopping around. Yeah, it'll be a fucking cold day in hell before Johnny Bench gets a hit. Hell will turn into a Dairy Queen by the time Johnny Bench gets a hit in this game. At least with that version. Is that deep? That's not deep. I've been seeing people crush home runs with Jackie. I have yet to see him hit one beyond the outfielders. Yeah, I would have shit my pants. Somehow, when I'm getting 3-0 counts, I'm getting the outs after it. I need a quick inning. Is that even possible? Fuck this, like, 20 pitch inning bullshit. Where is that going? Can him. Throw him out! <sighs> Don't do it. Do not do it! Please! I will give anybody $10. Jesus Christ, I almost kind of destroyed one with Bench. That's fucking... Oh my Jesus. Is Reggie out there flying in right field? I don't even know how the fuck he was even within 10 meters of that. All right. That, that needs to stop. What is this? Screwball in the dirt fucking hit. Come on, strike this asshole out. I'm not dealing with a two-run shot. This better be caught. This better be caught, killer. Sky 
Mickey hits that out every day. Mickey could turn the bat upside down and hit that out with the knob. When that clock in right center strikes zero, that's when the team goes off. Hickory dickory dock or whatever the fuck that was. Reggie's doing it again. He's hitting the clock. Oh, Jesus! Actually, don't, don't. Don't even lean into it. If there's one person I don't want to lean into it, it's Reggie. This might be a good time for a green light. Only if it's down the middle, though. No. But I would have only been tempted if it was it was lasering at my belt. Come on! Fuck sakes, man. I don't want him to walk, babe. I want to swing. That's fucked. That's beyond fucked up. I may have gone through a human being's hand. Damn it! That's getting him. All day. Actually, I don't want to be saying all day because I know for a fact. I have a hundred pitches already. I think Marischal has maxed out stamina, actually, so that might not even matter. Yeah, his stamina is still almost fucking half full. Marischal could probably bitch. Bi bitch. Pitch. I think I said bitch because Correa was up. I don't know if that was just... I was looking at him and then I said that. Yes, he did! Get rid of it, man! Man, after that first inning, that was looking ugly. This has changed beyond belief. Come on, bloop down. Hit him in the fucking face. My goal in this game is to just get a hit with bench. That's it. It's the only goal I have. Just mirrors the ball coming off the bat weird. I better pitch good with Marishaw in the next inning because this is like prime time to take him out. There's no way that's staying in, right? I'm not touching, I'm not touching anything. Hurry. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. Will he take Kluber out? He is. He's taking Kluber out. Thank fucking Christ. I don't even know how winning this. That is the best slider to ever be known to man. That is huge. Am I gonna fucking crumble to smithereens? No, I'm not. Reggie's up. There's no way I'm doing it. I fucking said! Oh no! <laughs> Babe! Babe is hot dogging out there in left field. It's the fucking eighth inning. Nice. That's no, that no, 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 no. There's no way that should have even been close to that line. What is he looking at? This, this in no way shape can go to the ninth, the bottom of the ninth, or the whatever it is. The top of the ninth with a one run lead. Get by him. Yes. That is the definition of speed on base. Now you send one to the gap. You send one to the gap. He's scoring. I'm sending him. I don't give a shit. Yes. Should I take out... Fuck, the game wants me to. Alright, I'm just gonna do it because the game wants me to. I'm gonna take out Marischal and I'm gonna fucking just, just let him go relax. I have enough good relievers to possibly get the job done. He's done enough. Come on! Damn it! Ladies and gentlemen, Frank just went 0 for 4. I don't want to be- actually, no, I'll wait till after the game to say it. I will say nothing of those lines. Come on, Raleigh. Deal on the hill! That's a big first two outs for who the hell is up at the- who was up at the bleep. Oh, shove it up your ass. I couldn't even tell you how confident I was that I was going to fucking blow that. That is a pitching performance, maybe for the ages. You know what I think I did that game? And this might be the first time in history it's happened. I think I kept Frank Thomas, Cody Bellinger, or wait, 